So you can see that I put you get it in dirt here. Why? Because I'm hoping I can score a touchdown with him and have him gain a level. As, uh, three points would put him over the six points he needs. And the best score is there just in case. Now he got a blitz, which is not nice. Especially since the the ball is going to arrive something somewhere around here, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Why doesn't he use his Minotaur? Ah, computer's so stupid. Come on. Good. The way things are going, Matthew the Rotten is going to be the, the only rotter who ever gets level 2 with our team. Seriously, 3 dead so far. Now we have how many left? 1, 2, 3. 3 rotters left. Wow. Well, the good news is that we can still buy one Vestigor and the Beast of Nurgle. So then you only have to use one rotter. <laughs> I'm not really happy with this, I, uh, e even so. Uh, we started with one player to spare, and now things are really, really awful. Okay, so now I'm in pretty good position to uh, advance he pushed me and tried to do something stupid again so now it's time to attack uh, push if I'm not mistaken yep I pushed again Good. Stunned. So now we can advance. So, if we look at, at the their backfield, the chances I'll score are pretty good. However, nothing's for certain in, bla in Blood Ball, so, yeah, keep watching. Near the dodge, we really need people with tackle. We only have one. Uh... Where is he? Here? Yeah, far goner. And since I'm not worried about this guy, since he'll have to run quite a bit to get back into the action, instead I sent far goner next to the Minotaur in case he tries to dodge out of my tackle zones. A tackle zone in this case. So, pushes my Nurgle warrior, Marquis de Sod, and misses his block both down, if I'm not mistaken. So, Duke Deader Than Dirt can get a bit closer, and La Vache Folle is able to help out a little bit. Oh. I like uh, the help I'm giving him here. Bringing the Nurgle Warrior here and hoping that, yeah, I was able to knock him to the ground. The time is kind of running out for the opponent when you think about it. <clears throat> Only five turns left and I'm on my way to score a second touchdown. Guy has extra arms. Eh? Eh. Ah, I hate that guy. <laughs> oh, fractured leg. <clears throat> awesome, except for one thing. 
since he was dodging away it's not considered to be a block so our Pestegor Rosie uh, does not get any points next turn Duke Deader than Dirt can score <clears throat> so if we look ah that's right I can't show you their their movement path anyway the Minotaur is a bit too far away to uh, to help. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, seven is his maximum. Here we go. <clears throat> yes. And now because I pressed the G button. No. Anyway, Pestigor, Fargoner, woohoo! Injures their Minotaur. Always fun to injure a big guy. You feel so <clears throat> accomplished when you injure a big guy. Yes, let's face it, they cost a lot of money and they're not easy to uh, get out of a game. So, since I have one reroll left. If I'm not mistaken, I might try to injure someone. I'm not too sure, though. We will see. No. Figured I would not take any chances. So, Duke Dead and Ender, seven points now. Which means he'll gain a level at the end of the game. So, time for defense this time. So, three turns left. Uh, maybe four for them, I'm not too sure. And sadly, the, the ball did not uh, go to the right place, so he was able to give, uh, give it to the player of his choice, which means Walgors. Hmm. And a bit of dumb luck on my part. Although, when you look at it, he still has his rerolls and doesn't really use them that much. That's annoying. I'll send another warrior here. Uh, oh no, that's right. Yeah, I just uh, put him back up. Go warrior goes in. I'm hoping to score another touchdown. Bringing Lavashfall in the backfield just in case someone gets past uh, my defensive line. And let's see. Only pushed. Stun. Too bad. Could have been worse. Especially uh, considering uh, Rabid Luke's. Oh man. Rabid Luke's fate. Even if he had not died, he had pinched Nair, so he would have missed two games. Oh, uh, was not lucky. And I did not have an Igor to help out. Uh, do they even have? Nah, they don't even have re regeneration. So anyway. <laughs> Pestigors do have regeneration, though. Same with Nurgle Warriors. Okay, only the the Rotters don't have it. Okay. Ah, so, two turns left for the computer, so the only way he can score is if he uses that, that one, or that one, and uses a lot of going for it. Anyway, yeah, 
and on, instead of just going to my back field, he comes back to do something completely unnecessary, a blitz. So now we already know that the computer simply cannot score. So it's just a question of avoiding injury and trying to score. Sadly, no rerolls. I got a push. Sadly, the beastman is alive and Fargoner will not be able to score. And now we have time to finish up the turn and let the computer have his way. Well, not, not have his way, of course not. Let him play his last turn as well. It was a pretty good game overall. Of course, we lost another rudder, but four injuries, hey, awesome. Not to mention, Duke Deader Than Dirt gaining a level. And where's the other one? Marky de Sod. Where is he? Lord Anthrax the Vile got two points. Awesome. In fact, I'll have something nice to say right after the game is over. Because I had a nice surprise.